Ah, oh, Nuno. Uh, part five of chatting at home. Why we're stuck in lockdown. Ah, uh, today I'm going to talk about restaurants in Orlando. Ah, uh, these are all my own opinions and what I liked about them and decor, food wise, and if I can remember rightly, the price wise. So. It's basically 20 I'm going to choose. They are from fast food, buffet style, sit down proper restaurants, and just take away. Well, that's basically fast food anyway. So, so anyway, number 20. You know, I don't want to shock you all, but you all probably think the same as I do McDonald's. You know, I mean, McDonald's is the same virtually wherever you go in any country. Uh, it's good, you know, I am at McDonald's quite a lot of times. And I enjoy it. But, yeah, you get hungry quite quick, don't you? So, it's nothing special. You know, it's a, it can be a cheap meal. I mean... What you, I mean, you can probably pay ten dollars for a large meal in in McDonald's with a milkshake. To me, you've got to have a milkshake, or like you know, milkshake only does have one drink where you can get unlimited sodas. So yeah, so number twenty is McDonald's, right? Number 19. Again, I hope I'm not going to shock you all. But again, remember, this is just my own opinions. KFC. Um, I, I do love KFC, actually. But, again, it's very similar to wherever you go. You get the same sort of thing. But only thing different in America is the portion size and... If I remember right, that you can get half a chicken, and instead of, you know, and you get a full breast. But I think in this country, in Britain, you can't. You don't get half a chicken. If I'm, I've not had a KFC for about six months, by the way. So, so that's why I said night team. It's again, it's quite cheap. You don't pay a lot, do you? I mean. With a family, you can literally pay, in this country, £16, well, about £15 for a, buffet, for a big bucket. So, milk, I've never had the bucket, but I think it's around $18, I think. It's still a great price. If you're with a family, go for KFC any day. And I've been, I've been to Orlando with my family and we don't do a lot of restaurants because well the price is so and you know we're we've always been a poor family we've never been rich like a lot of us so we go for the value right number 18 i do like the name it chuckles me bj restaurants Hmm. Wow, what can you say about BJ restaurants? Hmm. Lots of different food you can get in there. Uh, the only thing I didn't like about it, the food was okay. Bit expensive. And the service, well, it was poor. But I've only been in there once. So, and decor was quite nice. But the service was poor and we did make a complaint so uh well so that's why it's number 18 and when i go back i hope to give them a try again to see because you always got to give places three tries i believe uh first try if they win over you you like yep yeah, you go back again but i always believe you got to give places three tries 
Now 17 IHOP or as they used to be called International House of Pancakes. Now I haven't been there for many 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 years. So when I last went they were just called International House of Pancakes. I want to give them a try again because all I had back then was a pancake with a bit of ice cream with a bit bananas cut up. So I and I've been uh, what I've seen late when I last went out there. They, I think they do burgers, so it'd be nice to try something and see what it's like again. Decor was very plain that I remember. Uh if literally these all, all these restaurants I'm talking about are all on International Drive or just off it. This was right down the bottom of International Drive near Days Inn. So and it's right near oh, and it's right on the same side as the crazy gold place. So that one. Number sixteen Subway. It's basic, isn't it? You know, you don't pay a lot of money. You pay six, seven dollars, maybe a bit more, and you get what you get. It's nothing great, but it feels uh you know, but not you know, not great. So uh it's Basically, what you can eat, and it, it, and it can be refreshing to have a subway. Does you think when we go around America, all you'd be a lot of time to have is burgers, 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 steak, 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 burgers, 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 steak, steak, steak. Well, we do anyway. So it is a bit nice to have a sandwich, really. Number 15, basically, Burger King. Now, again, it's a fast food. Decor's all different, all different places, isn't it? Uh, burgers are nice, nice size. But, again, you get quite hungry, don't you? Yeah, it, you, you don't stay full, do you? So, again, I mean, that's what the name is, isn't it? Fast food. And um, you do get hungry after a while. So, but I have enjoyed many of their burgers. That's why they're number 15 in my list. And it, prices, yeah, Burger King is always expensive. It, it's a lot more expensive than McDonald's. You know. But the burgers, my old man used to always say, you pay for what you get. And that's true. Yeah. You know. So I've admit, I've always joined my burger from Burger King than I have from McDonald's. Right. Number 15. Outback, Outback Steakhouse. I've only eaten there once, so maybe I just didn't what I enjoyed. The steak was nice, but I had a steak there. So long ago. I think I only paid about $15. And I enjoyed it. But I can't really remember much about the place now. It's I don't think there was no well thatcher. But I, I'm pretty good remembering details. So it's a bit cloudy on there. So it obviously didn't well me over. Uh, so... Hmm... Number 13, Pizza Hut. Mm hmm. Pizza Hut. Again, you know, but portion size I found a lot bigger. Uh, I've eaten in Pizza Hut now. I've eaten buffet out in, and, and I've also had the meal, you know, where you order your own pizza when you're with a family. Um, they're both different. If you, if you know what I mean. Uh, the buffet style, it's actually the same if you get in the UK or I think the rest of the world, you go and help yourself to all these different pizzas they got on there. 
and where you have you sit down with your family and you order a big pizza and you share that don't you so you don't you know so but i found more enjoyable having to sit down with your family and have this one type of pizza and enjoying yourselves